on and excuse me while I work on some things here in my mind palace. It's got this really weird echo. echo. It's somehow gotten worse. 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 It's really annoying and loud. Listen, buddy, don't blame us because your mind is so empty. <laughs> What is up, everybody? And yes, if you remember from last time, I came up with this awesome mind palace to come to to reflect, meditate, and even work out some things in my life. Um, you mean I came up with? And I helped! Yes, you are my creativity and morality, so I didn't misspeak. Oh, I know that. I was just making sure that it was known. I was the side that did the most work and deserved the most credit. Boy, what an ass set to your personality, am I right? I didn't know you made jokes like that. What joke did I make? Not important. The bottom line is, I now have this new space, which is awesome! Things are changing, evolving, mutating. Nothing stays the same. Oh. They sure don't, and you're saying it like it's a bad thing. <laughs> no, I'm fine. I'm, I'm cool. You, you know what's cooler than being cool? I Ice cold! cold! All right, all right, all right. I should have rephrased that. But I was thinking the only thing better than being cool was being back in my place. Ah. Uh, Listen to that sweet, sweet non-echo. Wait, what gives? Where are my star thingies? Well, this place sure looks familiar. Sorry guys, the sudden change kind of freaked me out a bit. Why? I mean it. Why does this place look so familiar? Th this is my part. You know what this is. Why are you so off today? I'll tell you why. With sudden change, the heart tends to be confused. Well, I'm always confused. Ain't that the truth? Maybe I should clarify. More confused than on average. That sounds about right. You are so smart. You could solve anything. Why don't we talk more? Uh-oh. Feelings. Yep. Yeah. I've become sentimental. You're always sentimental. More sentimental than on average. But why? Is it because of that whole growing up thing? Do we need to revisit that? No, it's not that. I mean, Maybe that started things. I think it's the changes that have come so rapidly lately. I'm taking on new formats for videos, I'm traveling a lot more, even my wardrobe's been slightly updated. That all sounds flippin' sweet, man. It is flippin' sweet, man. I guess I'm just getting all reminiscent over what once was and shiz. Well, Thomas, everyone gets homesick from time to time. Do you, Logan? Patton, we are all fractions of Thomas's personality. That is impossible. With you, I'm always home. You need to chill out. I do need to chill out. Yes, yes! Patton, that's my name. Don't wear it out. Impossible, seeing as how I just learned about it in the last vlog. Truth. I don't know why these changes are causing this sudden surge of emotions, but we can deal with them, and we can keep moving forward. You with me? Yeah! Awesome! Epic! Additional affirmation. Wait. Ah. Oh. This is so close. What up, Anxiety? Just here to say I'm on your side. Whose side? My side. What am I arguing? Quiet. Just let me do the talking. Anxiety, this isn't an argument. We're all on the same side here. Really? I find that hard to believe. You wonder why all these changes are throwing you off? It's the lessening of steady constants in your life. Oh my goodness, that's right, Thomas, and you are a Taurus. When you're in these new settings and situations, you know something is off. What is? Something. You can't even give an example? Something is off. I hate it when you're just vague. Ah, anxiety, what do we do? Uh, no, you were listening to me before. Remember how smart I was? We have a bubble. The bubble is nice here, and anything you need to do, you can get done in your familiar bubble. That is not how dream chasing works! Oh, I do not like you. I don't get it. Last time you were on my case about whether here was where I needed to be. Yes, but lately... Are you just trying to counter everything I do? No, it's just... Then what? Your friends. You're always away from your... friends. Ah, oh, that's why I've been feeling more confused than beverage. Average. No, I'm not. You care about whether or not I'm around my friends? Look, let's not read into this and make it any more angsty than it has to be. We all know that I'm a bit... Dismal, monochromatic. Spicy! Whatever. And your really good friends, they help me out. They provide constancy. Oh, okay, fine. You and morality have a point. No. No! Possible alliance? Sure. Nerd? Great. Halfway. Thomas. Yes, friends are a positive, and I can appreciate having them in your life, even though they encourage nonsensical and unsafe behavior. They also can help with your overall mental health and well-being. But they're not going anywhere. You don't know that. Yes, they do. Shut up. They're not waiting on you to pursue their dreams, so you mustn't wait on them. They could be gone at any moment. Maybe all this traveling is giving them the impression you don't need them anymore. No, that's not true. Uh, uh, we're losing them. Come on, you're the creative one. Uh, ah, what if his friends never leave? Unrealistic. What if some of his friends take his sides? Why did I think it was a good idea to join forces with you? <laughs> You guys can shapeshift. There we go. Oh, yes. Being mental projections of your own personality, it kind of makes sense, don't it? Perfect! You guys can take on the forms of my friends, and I can have you with me, no matter where I go! Uh... If this will help, I am more than willing to participate. Which friend shall I be? Uh, easy. 
You're inquisitive, rational, and clever. You're going to be Joan. Oh, interesting. Nice. My face is immediately scratching. Oh, I'm going to look all okay. Patton, you're a goofball with a heart of gold, so you're going to be Terrence. Oh, oh, terrific. Different face, same terrible humor. Wish that was less me, but glad to have you aboard the pun train. That wasn't on purpose. In Roman. If you don't mind, Thomas, I am way ahead of you. Oh, okay. Valerie! A valorous choice. Hello! Did I do that like Terrence? Pretty accurate. Why Valerie? She's a dreamer, a fellow lover of Disney. But mostly I just finally get to sing some princess songs. I wonder, I wonder. You've got to stop her. Excuse me, I am still a man. A manly man. A man who is manly. All right, Roman, calm down. We're all still the same aspects of Thomas's personality. So he, him pronouns all around. All right, then you got to stop him. Anxiety. No, I am not playing this game. Oh, come on, anxiety. It's fun. I'm a fun guy who's fun size. Let Danny do it. It would behoove this exercise if all aspects took part. I'm comfortable just the way I am. And besides, Thomas, this isn't going to do any talent. Wh wh why? I don't know, just so much style. Change me back now! I think we can all agree that you're undeniably adorable. No! I'm trying hard not to like you right now. But you are just too darn cute! Oh, this is like a little kitten! Oh. Oh. That is a pleasant comparison there. So now I can be comforted with the presence of my friends wherever I... Oh, uh, look at this! What? How are you doing that? I just walked over here. Why haven't we thought to do this before? Can you stop breaking the fourth wall? It's not quite a fourth wall. It's really more of a single column in the middle of all of us. Nah, I don't want to think about that. Go back to your spot. Okay, I love you. I love you too. I am not okay with this. Oh, deal with it, JD, delightful. You know, JD from Heather's. I waste my best material on you. So are you content now, Thomas? Can we close the book on your back-to-back -back dilemmas? I don't know how the series would continue if we stopped having dilemmas. Easy, Meta Knight. We're recording the episode, not the DVD commentary. <laughs> See, you called him out for it, but then immediately took it more meta. Let's get back on track. Yeah. I think this could work. Might take a little getting used to. But you both deserve a pat on the back for this one. Did you just make a self-referential pun? Oh, yeah, I've been waiting to do it ever since I revealed my name. Up until that point, I was... Patent bending. Come up. You don't see me or anyone else making puns about our names. So. You're right. High five. Hey, we're, we're across... Down low. I do. Again. Again. Low again. I might scream. But you can't, because your volume's too low. Don't you dare. Again, you're dead to me. This is incredibly amusing. But... But? Yes, but. <laughs> but something is just not right about this. Perhaps we're not in the right alignment. What do you mean? It means maybe this combination of friends isn't quite a... Neat. Is that the correct usage? Oh, almost. You gotta be joking. You know I'm not. Allow me to demonstrate. Perhaps... <clears throat> Perhaps this is a better fit. Hmm. Stop doing this. Oh, oh, okay, I just love Joe with eyeshadow. He looks like a wet bandit from Home Alone. Oh, wait, you're a bandit? That doesn't make sense. <laughs> Me. No! Now one of us has to change. Whoa, I'm seeing double here. <laughs> Shouldn't have drank that Roman Coke. Wow. You are incorrigible. Don't know what that means. Guess I'm not the only one that needs vocabulary cards. Okay, guys, I don't think you switching around is helping. Of course it's not, Thomas, because that's not what you need. Do I act like Joan? No. Patton's pretty much just like Valerie. They're both loving and sweet and bubbly. I'm gonna hug you now. Okay, okay. You, you, you gotta go over there now. Oh, okay. Why is no one else doing this? Okay. All right. See, it doesn't feel right because we are not actually your friends. But we look just like them. Would it help if we attempted to behave like them? Hello, my name is Talon. I'm short and unthreatening. Real cute. I want to pinch your cheeks, but not quite Talon. Uh, cats. Viking metal. Vomit. Well, now you're just naming things that Talon enjoys. That raises so many more questions. There's no use, Thomas. Nothing beats the real thing. Well, then what do you want me to do? I know you want me to just stay at home, but change is inevitable. And I know change is a part of life, and my friends have their own lives, but they've always been there to... I will find my way. I can go the distance. Sorry, I just realized Terrence has a higher race than you, Thomas. Yep. El Principe es estúpido. What? It is my understanding that you speak Spanish, so I really wanted to help you get it through your thick, self-aggrandizing skull in both languages. You are vapid and slow-witted. Wow, that was a wounding remark. I thought we agreed to work as a team on this one. Besides, I learned Spanish first, so who's the stupid one now? Still you. Brilliant! 
Tataka. See? I know Spanish, too. No, that's like Spanish one. Did I make you proud, Logan? You proud me? You really need to chill. Okay, so as we were saying... Come on, Thomas! Life is an adventure! Embrace the chain! I'm trying to, but I don't know if I can! But not without your friends, Thomas. Okay, enough of you! What you were too powerful as Joan, somebody had to stop you. Why are you talking like that? Well, I've always talked to this way. No. I mean, this is how Joan has always talked. Not them either. Great kookumly poogumies, I don't know who I am anymore. I don't have to look like anyone to make sense. He's right. We are parts of a whole. Visualize aspects of your single personality. Your real friends are complicated, multifaceted individuals. None of them would fit neatly into any one of us. Nothing beats the real thing. I just said that. See? Am I at all? Like Terrence? No, you're not. I'm getting real sick of this. I know you are, Anxiety. This constant change is exactly what I was trying to avoid in the first place. I guess some change is unavoidable. You just need to keep the change. <coughs> Uh-oh, I just littered those pennies. Hope the coppers don't come after me. <laughs> Why did you switch with me? It was the last combo. Okay, you got it. How'd it happen? Yep. I'm frail! I'm breakable! Okay, Patton in the form of Joan is not happening. Got it. Okay, now you just like being Joan. Falsehood. Thomas, there is administrable change and inadministrable change. That's not a real word. Unadministrable change. Uh, Whatever. Change you can control and change you cannot control. I'm following. And then there's change you can control but shouldn't. Like changing me. True. Are you kidding me? Sorry, I chose Valerie first. So the change that I can't control is the fact that me and my friends are all moving in different directions. We have our own goals, our own dreams. That's something that can't and shouldn't be changed. But what we can control is our communication with each other. We can keep ourselves updated, vid chat, enjoy each other's company, even if we're not in the same place. I mean, some friendships even start online or by mail, and it's years before they meet. If they ever do, the spirit of the friendship doesn't fade with location or any other form of change. It's up to us. And if you're truly not happy with the change that's happening in your life, you can exercise what agency you have over that as well. You're right. Most changes aren't too far out of my control. That calms me down. Great. Well, could you use a little bit of that control to change me back now? No, oh, fine. Finally. All right, cool. Oh, okay. Halt, one more princess song. I'm wishing. Okay, I'm good. Okay, there you go. Oh, my precious bangs. <sighs> well, it was a valiant effort. Well, at least it was fun. Some change can be fun and entertaining. It was almost as if this whole video was an excuse to show us portrayed by your friends. Sorry about all that anxiety. Whatever. I'll let it slide because I do feel better. Yeah? Yeah. Maybe good enough to tell us your name? You are the last one, and even we don't know your name, so we're kind of curious. Well, okay. My name... It's Talon. Okay. That is upsetting. Well, <laughs> wait, is it Talon? No. You take turns changing me into different friends today and expect me to open up to all of you? Fat chance. Except you, Patton. You didn't do that. You're cool. Okay, well, we deserve that. How about we make it a rule not to change anybody who doesn't want to be changed? And for the record, I like you all just the way that you are. Glad to have you back to your old intimidating self. Anxiety be back soon. Well, I mean, I do feel better, so thank you guys. There's no replacing your friends, but there's no replacing us either. Very true. We will be your constants. Yeah, you will. One more hug before we... Guess I can't do that anymore. No more breaking the fourth wall, huh? <laughs> Air hug? Air hug. Mm, I feel better now. Thank you! Thank you, guys! And I hope that you all know of the changes you have control over in your life. The friendships you have don't have to be limited by distance, and if you're not comfortable with the direction you're going, there's no pressure. You can always make another change. Until next time, take it easy, guys, gals, and non-binary pals. Peace out!